Professor Liu is going to teach you another uh, selection structure. In this project, we have a text box to receive users' input of a letter grade. And the program display message based on the letter grade. Um, the message of uh, uh, the message for the letter grade A is excellent. The message for the letter grade B is above average. The message for both D and F are the same, which is below average. We learned that we can use uh, if then else uh, else and end if structure to select from 2 to 3 options. We can also e use if else, else if, and else if nest the if structure uh, to select multiple options. However, the if and else if, else if, nested if sometimes is very confusing. I would like to introduce another structure. It is called selected case structure. So on the screen, I have a if, else if, else if, nested if structure. It is quite confusing. I would like to change it to a select case structure. So instead of the nested if structure, I will change the code to a select case based on the variable string uh, grade. So this is what I'm going to do right now. So select uh, so select and I'm going to change case based on the variable string grade. Uh, the case A and um, message will display excellent. Instead of say an else if structure grade equal b, uh, I will change it to case b. Let me change uh, all now. Let me run the program for you.
Do you think this data structure is clean and easy to understand? Uh, I hope you like this video.